and welcome back to my channel in this video i want to share with you a very very small haul of some things that i bought and then a couple other things that i um i received from a company they sent me a credit to do a review of many things that i wanted to go and you know and get from their website but they did that on my spanish channel which is my main channel and it's not a homeschool channel it's a little bit of everything um, if you don't know about that, I'm going to leave um, the link down in the description box so you can go check it out. I already made the review video for them and you're going to be able to see that in my channel as well. And there were a couple educational toys that I, I got from their website, so I'm going to share that with you today. Um, so here it is. These are the two items that I received from their website. I also ordered... I think it was two other educational toys from them, but they didn't send it. So it was a thumbs down for that. But everything else was fine. I got these animal domino. The only thing I don't like about the box is that this is, you know, it's like a hole. So all the pieces can easily come out from here. Um, but, you know, I store them horizontally, so it doesn't matter. And um, it's a domino. It's very small, it doesn't have a lot of pieces, doesn't say in the box, but you know, I don't know how much, how many of them. And I like it because it's, it's fun, it's not like a big educational toy, um, at least not for my daughter. Um, it's a very easy game for her, maybe for toddlers will be better. Um, so you just have to match the animal parts to these, like this dock, dock goes like that. And you just have to match that and of course you can do all the things with dominoes um, I don't know if it says so here on the back I believe yeah like you can do all the games with dominoes not just that and then these I've, I've seen this on eBay and Amazon many times and they had them they had this set on the website so I was like I might just well you know go and get it um, so it's what you see on the box. Let me see if I can open it and I'm not going to open it the wrong side. Okay, because I already did this one. <laughs> I opened it the other side. Um, so my daughter put it back and she likes everything in its place. So she left this one empty because if you put things over here, then these ones won't be the same. Yes, she's like that. She, she likes everything in the place. But... Here you go. It has all the signs and it has the plus here. And then it has all the numbers twice. So it has each number twice except number nine. It only has one. Um, and I'm really sure that wasn't intended. It was a mistake or I don't know, something wrong with the packaging. And it has, I believe, 10 sticks for each color. And it has, you know, some of the Montessori colors. So I'm really happy and excited about this this game. And I think in the website only costs for like three, four bucks or something like that. The website is called New Dress. It's a fashion website, but it has a lot of things for kids like toys and clothes and stuff like that, decoration for the room. So I took advantage of it and I ordered these things. Now I got this other stuff from the Dollar Tree. This from the Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree, basically everything from the Dollar Tree except this stuff right here. Uh, this from the Dollar Tree is um, clear tape, as you can see. <laughs> and I use this a lot for um, laminating, you know, some cards and some sheets, stuff like that. Uh, I still don't see the need for laminator. I know they're really cheap and you can get really cheap uh, laminator sheets on Amazon, but you know, I use these tape for a buck and a buck and it cost it lasts me for a month or more. So uh, I might buy a laminator maybe in the future. I might need it more than now. Um, and then I got these uh, color code secret messages. It's a secret spy agent kit for my daughter. I already have another one for fingerprints and things like that. And I want to do a unit study that has to do with this kind of things. Um, I'll show you in the future and he said just one dollar. Uh, this one you're supposed to decode this secret message 
and I don't know if you have to write it yourself, I believe you do, because they have a blank sheet of paper on the back, the color pencils, pencils and the decoder filter, so it's really fun. And then I got these uh, Artist Neon Paper Pads, and these are awesome, and I got it at the Dollar Tree. Um, they had other, I think they had other designs besides this one, and it has many designs many sheets for each design. Well, not many designs. He has three, but I, I mean many sheets for each. And I really like that. And the paper is very much like computer paper. It's not too thin. Um, and then I got this one, which is plain colors. It has all these colors. And it has 30, where did it say that? I saw, okay, 30 sheets each. I also got this pick up pairs or memory, memory game. Um, 24 tiles and it's all about um, here on the back well it just doesn't show much um, it's all about transportation and um, we didn't do the transportation unit studies yet so this is gonna be a fun game for that it has all kind of transportations so if you have adultery nearby if you want to have a unit study that has to do with this Go take a look. It's you know just one dollar, and then I got this set of three uh, card games. It comes like this in a package. Look, all three of them. This is called Build a Word, and you have to match the word with the draw, you know, with the picture, and then make a word. Um, and then this one is you know you have to match numbers, um, and then this one is a puzzle cards a matching game I believe let me see let me take them out we have to match the how you say <laughs> the, the career with the name um, of, course the, of course the instructions are here so what's a V oh you have to match the top with the bottom oh I see okay all right, so yeah, you have to match the top with the bottom. Now these cards would have been great for when I had the the unit study of community helpers. You know, this would have been great. Does that one go there? Oh, it's a vegetarian nurse. Yep. Uh, did I say vegetarian nurse? <laughs> yes, yeah, a ve veterinarian nurse. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yes, it's a veterinarian nurse, not a vegetarian nurse. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, that's the game. And then this one, this is mainly the reason why I bought the pack. And then it came with this. And my daughter is not going to use this because, it's, you know, it's counting, I believe, 1 to 20 or something. Um, and she's too old for that already. So I might save this for a future giveaway or something. I just want to make sure that's what it is. Okay. So yeah, just number cards. Um, so I got that, and then also I got these cards at the at Christian stores that I went to visit, and it, it was a little expensive. It was like six six ninety something, so like seven bucks. But it's well spent because it's Bible story cards of the Old Testament. I wish they would have had the New Testament as well, so I can get both. And each card, I don't know if I read somewhere in the in the box that there were a hundred. Oh yeah, there it is. 100 no not that one where is it somewhere in the box it said that they have a hundred not a hundred i have 50 50 story parts of the old testament and it's hard to record with one hand <laughs> so yes i do these cards i make them myself i use word and then i laminate them and i do story cards for my daughter and this just you know <laughs> I have more than enough now and you can see their name you know in a picture of the story and then on the back a little story that's the story it tells you where you find it on the Bible and then on the bottom you have different questions about the story which is great so you know it's not a very long story you know so it takes like three minutes to read it you know, you can show the kids the picture while you're reading it and then ask them questions to make sure that they were listening. And then you can make the questions in a fun game or something like that. So that's the first story, number one. And it has numbers on the back. Well, that's number two, actually. Where's the number one? It should be maybe the creation of the earth. 
of the world and everything. So yeah, that was awesome. I love these cards and you know, I'm gonna include them in our word box for the week. And then I got these at Walmart for my daughter. And it has the erasers so she can have them here in this little caddy for her to use. And then I also got these at Walmart. Um, these are clips, very, very strong clips. And the magnet is very strong as well. And I plan on using them. There are four of them They just stick together. Uh, I'm gonna hang them from my whiteboard on the bottom whenever I need, you know, to put st things like for memory, memory work and things like that. I can hang these uh, cards or paper sheets or some something from the whiteboard. So this is my hole. I was gonna, I said it was gonna be a small hole, and it is, but I just talk way too much <laughs> and um but you know i just don't want to do a, a video where i show you things that i bought and that's it i want to tell you ideas of you know how i use things or things that i do with them and stuff like that so i hope that this video was helpful and resource you know and resourceful to you and uh, if you have any questions please feel free to ask thanks for watching and i'll see you next time Bye bye